Here is a little curio um, for you. This um, is supposedly Armalite 2, although it isn't because Armalite 2 never got released. It was supposed to be released in 1990, but it was canned by Thalamus after a guy called Robin Levy left. Apparently, from what I've been able to gather off Wikipedia, um, he left and there was nobody to finish the graphics style or whatever it is for the game and so apparently this is all you get now the eagle-eyed amongst you will spot that the only thing that's different is the main uh, design for the ship and it has these additional power-up pots either side of it however the level in the background um, it's strikingly similar to the level one of Armalite and I actually suspect that's what it is they just this is almost like a proof of not even a proof of concept but perhaps a design tester for the new ship and I suspect this is as far as they got with it um, that's even if this is genuine um, I don't know what this is there was rumors that two of the developers in 2013 were gonna get back together and do the sequel to it though, though they said there may only ever be one level and all of this type of stuff because of the distance that there was between them and the lack of availability of C64 hardware I don't know I don't know if this is this but um, it's there's no sound uh, you can see these glitchiness on the borders um, there's no high score being registered it's just essentially the like I say, for me, it's like a, a test for the new ship design. Uh, you, there's no power-ups. Um, there's no bosses. It just cycles. Occasionally, it pauses. Now, I don't know if that pause was something they were going to put into it, where it stops for a moment and you do something, then it carries on. Or whether that pause is actually because it's just cycling the same level um, over and over again. I suspect it might be the latter. Um, but yeah... It's hey, such a crying shame that Armalite 2 never got released for me because I absolutely love the original and you know it's surprising you know, Thalamus didn't go out of business in 1990 they they actually made games for another two or three years on the C64 um, so why they didn't bring somebody else in maybe I, I honestly don't know unless he held some kind of um, patent over the graphic design of the game or something like that I'm not sure but um, yeah I mean it was a Armalite was a successful game for the C64 it was very well received and so why uh, Thalamus didn't just bring somebody else in to forget somebody else to finish it off I don't know um, but apparently this is all there is of it if this is genuinely it I'm not say I'm not 100% convinced of it myself I'm sure there are more knowledgeable people out there that will but yeah I just thought I'd put it up there as a bit of a completionist really say so if the, the ROM was out there I guess this is where the end of level boss would be or whatever and as you can see there's nothing there it just goes through and then cycles back around again so I would say I just thought I'd stick it up there um, not really a lot else to say about it to be honest with you there you go allegedly Armalite 2 on the Commodore 64. Uh, thank you for watching.